only game show where you don't have to know anything to win. Here's your host, Jeff the Finn. There he is. This is what we call the lightning bolt. Welcome to Brain Surge, the show where all you need is a great memory and super concentration skills. Let's meet today's Brainiacs. to get out of trouble. Now that's rough. Deja's nickname is Swagalita. Hey, so is mine. Kathy once took the wrong bus home from school. Let's hope she doesn't take a wrong turn today. Aaron is a clarinet player who loves barbecue pork ribs. This explains the sauce on his clarinet. PJ once had a bird poop on his head. Let's see if that brings him some good luck. And Emma is a sci-fi fan with the nickname Spocky. I don't see any pointy ears. One of you guys is gonna go home a brain search champion today. And that's pretty good because you're gonna get your chance at thousands of dollars in prizes plus a sliming from head to toe. However, for the remainder of you, there is one way out of here, and that is down. Your parents might be watching. Do it later. I'm gonna go head over to the Brain Center so we can get started. Level one. Who here likes pizza? Yeah. Who here's buying me pizza? No one, okay. Well, you guys know how to play. You're gonna use that special game pod you got in front of you to lock in your answers. By the way, points do not come included. You need to earn those. This first level will test your ability to see things quickly. As always, I'm kicking it off today with a 10-point puzzle. Here it comes. I just downloaded four songs from this awesome new band. Check out the names of the songs as I play them. The first one's called Free Nerd. The second one's called Yeehaw. The third one's called Hey Dude. And the fourth one's called, Who Let the Frogs Out? Now, listen carefully as I replay one of those songs. Which song is playing right now? The first, second, third, or fourth song? All right, if you think you got this one right, give me your best rock and roll face to the camera. Yeah! All right, everybody's in. And everybody likes to rock. And I don't want to work on a show where people don't like to rock. Let's see what the correct answer is. Yeehaw! There it is. It was Yeehaw number two who got it right. Everybody's kicking it off with 10 points. That's the way to start the show. Yeah. All right, who's up for a 20-point puzzle? Yeah. yeah! That's what I'm talking about. Well, yeah. guess what? Here it comes. This pigeon is about to embark on a very disgusting mission. As he flies over the neighborhood, keep track of which houses he targets. In which pattern did the pigeon poop on the houses? PJ, that story speaks some truth to you, doesn't it? Yeah. You, you've been you've been pooped on by a bird, right? Yeah. Have sucks. you ever pooped on a bird back, though? No, it's too hard. No. Okay. Well, maybe that's a good way to retaliate. Let's see if you got the correct answer. Oh, it was two. Who got it right? I knew it was two. Yeah. Aaron, Emma, Isaac, and Kathy, congratulations. 20 points to your score. Here comes a 30-point puzzle. Roll it! Holly made friendship bracelets for four of her soccer teammates. Pay close attention to who gets which bracelet. This one's for Katie. This one's for Julie. This one's for Lori. And this one's for Sarah. Thank you. Which pattern was on Katie's bracelet? Friends make friendship bracelets. Real friends make friendship belts. 
That's right. This the one milk. is from me to you guys. Thank you. All right, let's see what the correct answer is. Go Tigers! It was number one. Yeah. Who's getting 30 points? Aaron and Emma, congratulations. Add 30 points to your score. Speaking of scores, let's take a look. Tied for first with 60 points apiece is Aaron and Emma. Congratulations. Tied for second place with 30 points apiece is Kathy and Isaac. And PJ and Deja are rounding it up with 10 points apiece. It is anybody's uh, game. It is very close. And this puzzle right here is worth 50 big ones. And I'd like to do nothing more than to show it to you. Check out my new high-tech food maker. I went to make some applesauce, but a worm crawled into one of the compartments. Keep track of which compartment has the worm. Which compartment has the worm? You have got to be kidding me. That one is impossible. Let's see what the correct answer is. For 50 points, here's a replay. Does one of those. It was at number one. Remind me never to get that food maker. Who got it right? Emma, congratulations. That's 50 points. Okay, we are down to our last puzzle. After this, the four of you with the most points are going to advance to the next level, and the other two are going down the, the brain drain. This puzzle right here is worth 100 big ones, so it's still anybody's game. Game face, roll it. My doctor is about to give me an eye exam, but I think I may be wearing the wrong glasses. Pay close attention to which letters I say correctly. S T N H I O W M T and X. Which four letters did I get right? Time's up. All right, how how do we do on this one? 100 points on the line. I didn't turn it in. Oh. Oh. DJ does not look happy. Okay, let's see what the correct answer is. S, T, N, H, I, O, W, M, T, and X. Snuff was number yes! three! Yes! Deja and Aaron. Isaac, Kathy, and PJ just didn't get their answers in on time. Okay, now it's time to find out which four of you are moving on to level two and which two are going down. No! The With 160 points is Aaron. Congratulations, buddy! Oh With 110 points in second place is Emma. Nice job. And Emma, you are tied with Deja, who also had 110 points. Woo! Okay, there are three of you left, and only one more person can move on to the next level. And we have a tie at 30 points. However, getting all of her answers in the fastest is Kathy. Congratulations. You're moving on to the next level. Isaac and PJ, you guys played a great game. And before we send you down the brain drain, let's find out what you've won. Congratulations. You've won a Nintendo DS Lite. The Nintendo DS Lite is a dual screen handheld game console developed and manufactured by Nintendo. All that and a bucket of slime. There's only one way out of here, and that is down the brain drain. PJ Isaac, you guys ready? All right, PJ, come on down. Make it great sound. He's gone. Yeah. All right, Isaac, come on down.
Marge, that looks like a lot of fun. Emma, your hair is going everywhere. <laughs> Outstanding. Congratulations to you four brainiacs for making it to this level. Let's get to know you guys a little bit. How about it? Aaron. Oh, you play the clarinet. Have you seen the new video game, Clarinet Hero? Nope. No, it's awesome. You should get it. It's yeah, very yeah. good. You'd probably be, like, really good at it since you're a pro. Emma. You got the nickname Spocky. How'd that come about? Well, I like a lot of sci-fi shows, including Star Trek, and my friend just started calling me Spocky one day. Got it. Have you ever done the pointed ears thing? For Halloween, actually. Very nice. Way to take it full circle. Very good. Deja! All right, you want to be a professional basketball player? Yep. Who's your favorite player? Lisa Leslie. Lisa Leslie. Mine, too, which is a coincidence. Nickname Shorty, how'd that come about? Well, I'm usually the shortest in my grade. Well, you know what? You've made some big points in level one, so shake it off, okay? <laughs> Here we go. Enough chit chat. Let's get to the game play. <laughs> level two. All right, guys, on this level, I am going to tell you a story from Jeff's big book of super fantastic true chronicles of truth that are absolutely true. Stand up, it's story time. Pay close attention to what you're about to hear and see, because everything I'm going to tell you is 100% absolutely true. Growing up, I shared a bedroom with my little brother, Bobby. He was always getting into my stuff, like when he kept taking my butt scratcher 2000. So I decided to divide our room in half, everything 50-50. I got our cat Fluffy. Bobby got the litter box. The bathroom was on my side of the room, but I forgot that the toilet paper was on Bobby's side. The TV was on Bobby's side of the room, but I had the remote. But I have the batteries. I realized my calendar was in no man's land, so I finished the line with a jar of honey I found under my bed. But all that did was attract a bear. The bear grabbed Bobby's blankie, my really cool cowboy hat, and the remote control. But I've still got the batteries. Not anymore. Now, even though our TV gets 738 channels, this bear watches bowling 24 hours a day. Maybe Bobby's not such a bad roommate after all. That's my story, and it's all 100% true. All right, you guys know how to play Aaron. First question is to you. When I ran out of blue paint, what did I use to continue painting the line on the wall? Yellow paint. Yellow paint. Sit and hold. Oh, no, Aaron. That means you're wrong. Emma, same question to you. When I ran out of blue paint, what did I use to continue painting the line on the wall? Honey. Honey, have a seat and hang on. You got it. That means you're right. Deja, what animal did the honey attract? Brown bear. A brown bear. Very nice. Congratulations. <laughs> Kathy, what sport does the bear like to watch on TV? Bowling. Bowling. That means you're right. Emma, back to you. The pressure is on. What is the full name of the item Bobby took that forced me to divide the room in two? The Butt Scratcher 3000. The butt Scratcher 3000? Oh, no. Hang on, Emma! It was the Butt Scratcher 2000. The 3000 doesn't come out until next year, and I can't wait for it. Deja, Kathy, congratulations. You guys are moving on. Normally, here is where I'd like to do a knockout round. Instead, I'm going to take a nap. <laughs> and I'm back. Did I miss anything? <laughs> no? OK, let's do a knockout round now. Knockout round. All right, behind those numbers are pairs of images from the story you just heard. Match a pair correctly, you stay in the game. I'm going to give you 10 seconds to memorize the board, and that time starts right now. That 10 seconds goes fast. Deja, we're going to start with you. What's your first number? Five. Five. And your second number? Six. Six. You got yourself a match. All right, Kathy, how about it? One. 
One. And four. And four. From where I'm standing, that's a match. Deja, back to you. Eleven. Eleven. And twelve. And twelve. Ding. Kathy. Two. Two. And nine. Oh, not a match. We are now in sudden death territory. The next correct match is today's brain search champion. Deja, what's Two. your first numbers? Two. And 13. And what number? 13. 13. You played a great game, but you know how this happened, right? Have a seat and hang on. Deja, 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 you are moving on to the final stage as a champion, where you can win thousands of dollars in prizes, plus a sliming from head to toe. Let's see what Aaron, Emma, and Kathy won for making it this far. Congratulations, you've won an electric guitar. The Schaefer Electric SST guitar is designed by Schaefer and Sons. There's only one way out of here, and it's down the brain drain. Aaron, Emma, Kathy, are you guys ready? Come on now! Here he comes! All right, Emma, come on down! Yeah! You may remember her from kicking butt on level one and two. How's it feel? Awesome. It does feel awesome. Deja just told me she watches the show every day. And I say that's because true fans end up right here, where you are about to play the final stage of Brain Surge, where you could win thousands of dollars in prizes, plus a sliming you are never going to forget. Level three, the final stage. This level's got three parts. Each one's more difficult than the last. It's your job to memorize the light pattern that appears on the floor and recreate it by stepping on the squares in the right order. You're gonna start off with the four by four, then you're gonna stop the clock. How do I do that, Jeff? Good question, Deja. It's that orange button right up there. Boom. Then the five by five and the six by six. Complete all three paths in 90 seconds, and here's what you could win. Complete the four by four and win Wenzel camping gear. Wenzel camping equipment includes two mummy bags, tents, hydration packs, and air beds. Complete the 555 and win a Wii and video games from EA. A Wii gaming system and prize package of EA games. Blast targets and Nerf and Strike 2 Elite. Have a pet party and Lilith's pet shop friends. And play Hasbro Family Game Night 2 with up to four players. Complete the 6x6 and win a San Diego getaway. Coronado, one of San Diego's only beachfront resorts where you can surf, bike, boat, or just relax in the sun. Okay, I got 90 seconds right here. I tucked in my sock. Here, put that up on the board for me. It's a little sweaty. Sorry. Apologize. There it is. Nice toss. Okay, here is your first path. Take a look. All right, you're going to see it twice. Deja, the clock is going to start when you make your first step. Good luck. And she's off. Come on back, come on back. Take a look, here it is again. All right, shake it off, you got it, go ahead, the clock is running. She's got it now, she's got it now! Deja, that big, huge smile on your face said, Jeff, guess what, I just got myself some camping equipment. Nice job. Here is the five by five. Check it out. Okay, this is very doable. You got plenty of time. 
clock will start when you make your first step. Good luck, Deja. How about it, audience? <laughs> All right, hurry back. That's OK. Shake it off. Here comes the path again. <laughs> That's okay. You want to know why? Because now you got it all out of your system. This is where, this is for all the marbles right here, okay? You got yourself the camping equipment. You got yourself the Wii and games. Awesome. You're not going home empty handed. You got 14 seconds left. And here is your six by six. This is for the trip and the slime. All right, take a look. Here comes one more time. All right, here he goes. She's on. This. All right, go ahead, be careful. Two. Oh, come on over here, Deja. You ran out of time. No big deal. You got yourself the camping equipment, right? You got yourself the Wii games. And you know what's second best to getting slimed around here? A trip down the brain drain. Why don't you head over there and I'll meet you there. That's all the time we have today. Tune in next time when we have six new Brainiacs go head to head to head to head to head to head. Only on Brain Surge. Thanks for watching Make Feel New York. All right, Deja, you know there's only one way out. Come on down. Here she comes. Hey. And she's out. Tomorrow, get ready for two, two times the brain power. That one is impossible. And two times the slime. Oh, it's so good. Because Brain Surge is back with two weeks of brand new episodes. Awesome. So see if you... <laughs> Crazy. ...can handle Brain Surge times two. Oh, yeah, I think I can do it. Two weeks of brand new Brain Surge continues tomorrow at 6. Only on Nick. I don't think it's ever going to stop.